on first down. Every snap crucial the rest of the way. We're drawing near a close, and the defense is trying to preserve a victory. Ahmad Bradshaw with the carry, taken down at the 21. In this defense, they are tough. When you run that football, they got some men up front, and that time they stopped that run just for a short game. Second down coming up. Time, obviously, a factor the rest of the way. The Colts line up, split backfield. Bradshaw lines up in the backfield. From the gun, looking across the middle, and Williams in on the tackle. Well, when you play in this cover three defense where three defenders are playing deep, that's great. You stop the deep passes, but who's going to stop the quick ones? Well, nobody. That's why the quarterback and the receivers are having really good success throwing these slant patterns. The Colts from the 27. Makes the catch in open space. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. And, Phil, we see the numbers now. You think when a quarterback is posting numbers like this, they would be leading, but that's not the case. It is not the case, Jim. The defense has really struggled today, even though the quarterback and the offense making a lot of nice plays. It's not enough. The defense, they have to step up. First down. Pressure on every snap now. That was a big gainer. Now it's time to back it up. And now on first down, they'll go back to the air. Reggie Wayne makes the catch. The Colts will need to get to about the 35 on this drive in order to kick a field goal. Second down, late in the fourth quarter. On this passing down, the defense comes out in the nickel. Second and three. He's got the catch. And that brings the play to an end. The Colts decide to take a timeout here, leaving them with only one. First down. Let's see what they come up with here. Split backfield here. The Colts snap it at the 26. Very nearly intercepted. Well, you can't blame the coach trying to go for the win. They're deep enough to do something with it, but still almost having that intercepted and taking away the opportunity for a tying field goal. Well, I'll say this, Jim. If that ball would have been intercepted, they would have been blaming the coach because he made the play call. But the coach trusts the quarterback. The quarterback's just got to be smarter. Second down here. Double tight end formation. Trying to work that left side, and he's brought to the ground. The Colts use a timeout to talk over things before calling what should be the final play. The game on the line right here. He hits this, and we're going to overtime. the watch of the game with you and how about a final thought about that victory well you know Jim I wish I could say the same that I enjoyed spending these last three hours with you but that's just not the case but no just kidding of course nice win they got to feel good about what they've done and uh, uh, celebrate a little tonight I think I'll see you next week maybe what a memorable game this truly was for Phil Simms, Danielle Bellini, and Larry Ridley, Jim Nance saying so long for now, and we leave you with the GMC Never Say Never moment of the game.